Hello everyone and welcome back to the Node.js course. In this lesson, you will learn about partials. Let's go ahead and select our index.ejs file. When you scroll to top, you can see we have our now. But the thing is, that code is containing in our other files, including create.ejs here, and then about page, and then 404 page. But it could be contained in more files. It can be 10, 20, up to 30 view files. Then it is very difficult to change this now inside of each and every files. That's why we can move this now code, otherwise maybe another code into one file and use that code inside of each and every views. The solution that we are going to use known as partials. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and create a new folder inside views folder and I'm going to say partials for that. Now, we are going to use now. That means I'm going to create a new file there inside partials folder. I'm going to say now.ejs. Okay, now let's move into index.ejs and I'm going to just cut this now code and paste that code inside now.ejs file okay now we can save that and go to index.ejs how we can import that code into here to do that we are going to use the function known as include to use that we have to output we can say starting angle bracket and then percentage sign now this time we have to say minus sign known as hyphen instead of equal sign because equal sign escape special characters inside of html file then it will return a string value instead of a html code to avoid that we are using hyphen here now we can say include function inside this function we have to say the relative part to the file that we are going to use we can say dot forward slash that means we are in the root folder and then we have partials folder inside there we can find now dot ejs file okay now we have to say percentage sign and in the angle bracket that is all and we can run this by saying in the terminal nodeman now app now open your browser go to localhost colon and your port number now we can see the same now as earlier all we have to do is just copy this code and Go to create.ejs file and replace this now with that code okay and also let's go to about.ejs and let's replace that now with that code include function and then go to 404 i'm going to replace this now code with include function okay that is it and we can just go to our page again let's go to about we can see the same now okay now we need some footer below of page to do that we are going to create a new file here new file and i'm going to say footer.ejs here i can say the footer tag inside that i can say copyright and then copyright symbol to get that we can say ampersand and then copy and finally semicolon and 20 20 okay that is it and let's go to index.ejs below of all codes above of body ending tag i can say starting angle bracket percentage sign and then hyphen include function and the relative path to footer code we can say here dot forward slash and then partials folder inside that we can get the footer.ejs file okay that is it and let's in this one finally we can just copy this code and paste that inside create one also in the about page and finally in the 404 page all right now we can run this we can see copyright 2020 let's go to home page that is it and let's go to code again now we can move this head code into another code to do that i'm going to say 
new file here and I'm going to say head.ejs inside that we can paste that code and let's go into index.ejs file again now we can just copy this code and paste that here and replace that with our head.ejs let's go to another file we can replace that with include function and the file is head.ejs all right now let's go to about replace that with include function the last one 404 replace that with include function like this okay now we can run we can see the similar output and the title okay that's how partials make our code look better okay that is it for this lecture i'll see you in the next lecture thank you